Hi, I've been busy reading my Kindle and I've finished a net galley arc that is one that I have been looking forward to. It's Cursed by Marissa Meyer and it's the second in the duology um, that takes the, that spins the Rumpelstiltskin story. Uh, the first book, Gilded, I read last September, September 2021. And this is the, the sequel, and it comes out in November. And as a sequel, it doesn't disappoint. Sometimes sequels can disappoint, but this one doesn't. It keeps the pace, it keeps the fantastical, magical element to it. Um, and the ending, well, the ending is, well... Um, it's very difficult to talk about sequels because some people approaching this video might not have read the first one. So it's difficult without giving too much away about the first one to talk about the second one. But we are still in the Earl King's domain. Um, Cyrilda is still in his castle as a prisoner. Um, and she is still, um, she still has this relationship with Guild, who's this poltergeist. Everybody in the Earl King's domain, demons, monsters, they're, they're almost the undead. And this is his, his court, his kingly court is this, um, court of undead people, of monsters, of ghouls. And every full moon, the hunt can slip through the veil into the mortal lands and capture beasts, capture humans. And this is how Cyrilda came to be in his court. The first book ended with a real cliffhanger. It ended with a wow moment and you were waiting for this second book. And the second book is now here. And the Earl King is still wanting to capture all the gods. He is still trying to, to get the gods um, because he wants to resurrect or get back from the um, realm of the dead his lover Perchta. So this is his aim to capture the gods. We He is such a nice, well I'm going to say a nice villain, he's a, a villain that you see in this one almost a romantic side to him. He's a really sort of He's a devious villain. He's an evil villain. But you could almost see a, a romantic side in this. He's quite likeable in this one in at times. Um, as well as wanting to catch the girl, gods to get his lover back, when he captures the gods, he wants the veil that only rises at full moon to be lifted as well, in which case he will have total power over the mortal lands, over men, over the humans. Um, you've got more monsters in this one. You meet the gods in this one, which you didn't really meet in the first one. And the story just keeps you going. And it is... I can't. I don't want to give too much away because if I give too much away, then you know what happened in the first book. And if if you didn't haven't read the first book, I don't want to spoil it for you. But as a sequel, it didn't disappoint. I loved it, and the pace just kept on the way that the way that the first book did. It's a perfect carry on, a perfect sequel, and uh, it's a duology. So that is the end of the Rumpelstiltskin retelling, almost reworking. So yes, this one comes out on the 8th of November, Cursed by Marissa Meyer. Um, if you've read Gilded, you will love Cursed. 
if you haven't read Gilded, go on and do it. So, happy reading. Take care.